I want to convince you to care a lot about early childhood education. This issue connects poverty, criminal justice, healthcare, families, jobs, and it comes with the potential in a time when we are deeply divided to unite us all around something really important. Early childhood education is a game changer. The evidence is overwhelming. Just to kick things off, here are a few hundred studies that say it's a good idea. But it's more than just a good idea. This could be the key to breaking the generational cycle of poverty, which would help us gain ground on every other social challenge. Let's talk about learning to read. Ages zero to eight form the literacy bridge. If kids don't get across that bridge, if they aren't proficient readers by the end of third grade, life just got a lot harder for them because that's when they're supposed to go from learning to read to reading to learn. The students who don't get across that bridge end up watching as all the other students pull further and further away. The consequences are severe. The vast majority of our high school dropouts and our juvenile criminal offenders are kids who didn't make it across the literacy bridge. And even for those who graduate, you can imagine what not being able to read well does to your employment opportunities. Early childhood education is where we win this fight. Learning to read doesn't start when you're seven and it doesn't start when you're six. The truth is we have a lot of kids showing up to the first day of school having never held a book, not knowing a single letter of the alphabet. Most of the kids who start that far behind never fully catch up. Early childhood education and programs that focus on parents reading with children can help close the literacy gap before it opens and reduce one of the major financial strains on working families and generate a seven to one return on our investment and unite us all around something crucial. We can disagree on all kinds of stuff, but we all agree kids deserve a chance to escape poverty. And for most of them, early childhood education is the most effective and cost-effective way to do it. North Carolina has a history of coming together around early childhood with Smart Start and Pre-K, but it still adds up to only about 1% of our budget. If we make it just 2%, we can get tens of thousands more kids across that literacy bridge each year and permanently elevate their potential and their children's potential. That's why you should care about making early childhood education one of the next big things we do together.